بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته Welcome friends and in this tutorial and we are going to start with shortcuts and these are ready for the shortcuts so you should know them before going further let's open our office Excel not office it's office 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 whatever and I'm gonna expand this so first our first thing is let's go to clipboard if I have anything no we don't have anything so let's say that same thing January I'm gonna just click on this expand uh, keep expanding so first of all you know this uh, that this is a shortcut and it really works and for example if I have one two so I can select both of them not first because because if I select first it will give me all the tools okay I'll choose both of them and now expand so it will give me until unlimited for example I can I'll go to 33 so for again if I choose click one two and select both of them and this appears if I click on this I can just choose this stuff like that for example greater than which one is greater and which one is smaller and what are top 10 and clear formatting so these are formatting tab these are table tabs I can create table from them I can so you can just uh, work on them but color the scale for example uh, coloring this is coloring this is doesn't concern you now so you don't have to worry about this for now okay now let's say I want I have a line for example let's say I want one two and I have a line of uh, these numbers for example let's suppose these are names okay and I want to copy these names in here too in apparent section so I'll just go in copy and click in here and click paste so these will get pasted suppose I have uh, <coughs> 5,000 excuse me 5,000 what was excuse me I think sometime I am very 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 stupid acting like that okay whatever suppose you have 1,000 so how will you copy them all of them so all you need to do I have showed you this way but not in this way so first of all you need to copy so control C and select the areas you want to paste to by by keeping pressing on control you can select all of them and now just control press control V and all of them are here easy as that so go to, and just control Z to go back I step and control Z again to go back two steps and stuff like that control Y to go up the to go to the forward step like you can click these buttons these work okay now let's see let's suppose I want to go to the end of this sheet let's say I have this sheet up to oh sorry let's say I have this sheet up to keep going keep going keep going yeah, yeah 101 so the problem is I want to go to 101 let's say I want to go to 1001 how will I go let's say I scroll 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 I have somehow I mean somehow it took time but I went to it did take that much I and I'm there in 101 in cell number uh, 102b cell okay but if let's suppose I want to go to 1000 let's see how much time will it take okay 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 1000 1000 1000 1000 1000 1000 1000 1000 1000 1000 1000 1000 and let's say I type in here 1000 and it's calling again sex 
and I want to readjust this so if I click on the corners I will readjust, readjust this now I have another, uh, I'm here and I want to go back to 100, 1000 again I don't want to scroll all the way it really takes time so what control down arrow you will get to 101 easily and control down arrow again and you are on 1001 and control down arrow again and you are at the end of the list control up arrow you are 1000 in here and if I just from here left no, sorry right control right arrow so you will just re be redirected to add in August so what it means for example let me give you an example from here let's say I have nothing in here and in here something and I have in here something not there is no uh, there is space between the two of them and I'm gonna just decrease the size a bit decrease that size a bit so if I click in here and control right so when there comes space it uh, stops before this space and when I from here if I click on control right it will ignore all the spaces between these uh, between this and this for example there are a thousand so it will ignore them and just let uh, and uh, just it will go in the cell which has text so in our case let's see in January from January to it will give me to 100 get me uh, it will me redirect me you can say at 101 when I click control down arrow so 102 sorry and the uh, value is 101 and if I re-click it it will get me to 1000 the space between uh, he ignores them and just and then the last one if I control right right and right the last cell we have in columns okay so this was our um, tricks or oh, sorry you can say tricks or shortcuts F, so you can navigate every, anywhere and let's say I have this I want to uh, move it in here how will you move it you will control X or just click on the this scissor and paste it so you have more moved it and it really works but if you have a very 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 long uh, thing for example I didn't select all of them I couldn't select actually all of them because these are really really long so how to do this control Z so go in here press control shift down arrow so all the cells before sp uh, space will be selected and you can just click on here and paste it okay well I have a question doesn't it hurt or doesn't it hurt you when you just go select these cells control shift down here and go and cut and paste it takes lots of time so how to minimize that time just go in here uh, at the corner as you can see when you see all the arrows four dimensional arrow so right click on it and you can just drag them in here for example I want it to be in April and I can move it here and again I can copy it here so let's me give it some uh, some stuff like that like yeah this and this okay sorry all borders and as you can see it looks beautiful and now I drag it and say move it as values only so these are values only no formatting and if I just click uh, control shift down arrow and uh, let's say go in here and move as formats only so there will be formatting no values like this so you can actually uh, have fun with it for a while of course and I want the values only to be copied here so values only and uh, I have full, full of the product full of the result that I had in the earlier in here 
okay the thing now I want to teach you for example I have this let's say I have a sum formula sum formula which says in here select this and control shift up arrow and now only can shift down arrow so I skip so I'll skip January so I can um, go down to January only and control enter so let's see what is our results 5151 why did I click control plus control plus for example let me show you I want to add these two values so what I'll do I'll use sum and uh, select these two values okay and if I click enter it will go down but F2 I think yeah F2 so it will open the when you go on some thing for example when I click on control enter it will remain the cell will remain this it will not go down go down so the active active cell will remain that one and I like to do that it's a good habit of uh, because you need to just put similar values like this and just for example 200 control enter so you have to when you do that you can just put the similar values I think I have no I have showed you uh, shown you this trick or this shortcut uh, in the previous tutorial so as you can see we have this result so by going any further I want to uh, tell you something like uh, like what the hell I can just go control Z, Z, Z. yeah now as you can see let me copy these formulas in here and these formulas in here so I have formulas in all of all of this out let's suppose you have a situation in which you can't tell where is the formula and where which one is the value first of all second of all there you have a very big sheet and you can't find the, the formula you want so what to do in that case you have to go to control plus tilde and as you can see tilde is under skip key which looks like uh, this one this is tilde let's say this one okay so this one this guy in here is called tilde and my when I click on control tilde you can see that all uh, all the formulas has opened for me and tells it just telling me that this is formula this is formula this is formula formula not formula it's formula I'm not I'm not an American so I have a not American accent but pretty much pretty much works okay as you can see all the formulas are open so when you have lots of uh, very big sheet and you are searching for some formula it really works for you and it's a great way of working with it and if I can remember correctly and I think I am I am remembering correctly. So how to go back to uh, without formulas? When you uh, you have shown formulas, you have worked on it, and uh, you want to go back to the normal view. Just press Control tilde again, and you will be back. I think if you go to in here and uh, let me check out uh, data column console. Well, it is in here, but I can't um, don't remember where it is. And uh, it was I, I am sure it was in here somewhere when I was in 2010 version, and it should be in here, but I can't find it because I don't use that stupid thing. Um, well, you can search for it or, or Google it. I don't. 
have any problem with it but I like to use the shortcut and it's really cool and the last thing is flash fill and that one is in here so if I click on flash fill we looked at all of the data next to your section and don't see any don't see patterns for filling values okay I think I should go I have a door note 